Welcome back to Let's Play Chan Ankles. No, no Grimrock shards, and we're just here with our two party members here, Lan and Glenn. We're gonna see what fate lies in store for him, for them, I should say. And we're now just in a different area of Katara. See, we're here on the left side. We should probably just try to be careful here because it's only now just the two of us. We definitely want to still loot as much stuff as we can. That's what for the crystals. Ooh, that's, um, yes, give me this. I want to build a chain for Ultra Move. Hopefully we can get some more of those. That's going to be a part of a build that I'm going to be working on. Oh, nice. He's shiny. So there's armor break him. I think these guys are weak against fire. Oh, no, they're weak against wind. They don't have access to that, man. But they're strong against water, right? Yeah, so we have to use fire. Fire thrust. Fortunately, the game knows it's only two of us, so it's not, not going to fight. A whole bunch of enemies unless you go off the beaten path. Oh my god. That shit hurt. Uh, can you heal, heal him again? Yeah, don't do that again. That's like cross slashing. Oh my lord, now I'm out of MP. Tough battle. Yeah, I see one of those water flies are just giving us trouble. We'll definitely take that. You have the right, yeah, you do have the life for it. Just 15% chance of getting a crit, that's all. Anything else? I think there might be something over here in this side of the forest. Another one. Oh, I'm gonna break you. Yeah, because I wasn't in um overdrive, so heal all costs like 35. It was just regular attack and just have it built up. Now we can go for this. We will save that. Go to your next attack. There we go. Now we can pop it because we don't lose our overdrive. Gotta go, go in there with the cross slashes. And we'll just fire thrust and that should take care of you. No? Alright, take another one. And with the bamboo fiber, I'll take that. Also, another cheeky item hiding in the forest. If you want to try to find every chest, I mean, it's good because, you know, it, it fills up the request board and you get items. And that's B, so definitely that. Anything else over here, I think that is about it. I think we need to climb, just climb up here. A long-ass climb. Hurry up. And we just picked up a random-ass rock. Now I got to drop down and grab this chest, too. Alarm clock? that just pure sleep eye drops definitely take that that's the way we came from so he's gonna climb up once again we run pretty fast in this game but you know it's a big it's a big mountain we have to get through just to get to uh, Tormon that's not a breakable all right we get a newt I think there's also something over here or <laughs> it's just a shortcut to drop down Son of a bitch. I, yeah, I realized my mistake after it was too late. So it's been many months since I played this section. God damn it. Now we have to drop down here and continue. Not pick the wrong one. Yeah, okay, cool. Because that was just a shortcut to get down on that side. How are we doing on some of these? Zero. And some of these enemies we can't really fight. Seven. I think that unless we get like two more collectibles, I think that's pretty much what we're gonna get for a while here. Nice. Sky armors. There are X three hundred P models. That's unbelievable. They're the most recent models produced by MRC. They have double the horsepower of the previous models and use less fuel at the same time. This is the biggest generational jump between models since the P100 series. Look how smoothly their joints twist before changing directions. It's beautiful. Your passion does, does you credit. <laughs> uh, look over there. Man, you, you got some crazy eyesight. They're mobilizing for war. How horrible. Lord, Lord Gustav Ramir is aligned with Tarn. We should steer 
a white birth around this village. Lemire, I've heard this name only recently. Lord Gustav is Rao's father. He's the son of an earl? That explains a lot. Don't speak ill of him. Uh, he has gone through, through much. Sorry, you seem to know him well. During the war, Lord Gustav rebelled against my father, but he was quickly put in his place. Rob was taken as a ward to the royal castle. There he grew up with me, as a life as a hostage. He was a son of an earl, but he was not treated any better than a court maid. That must have been very painful for him. I'm sorry, I didn't know. You're awfully sorry for something. Don't be. I'm so, I mean, I'm... Okay. All right, anyway, let's move on. You hear my footsteps as I'm moving off screen. There you go. <laughs> Took a little bit of the load there. <sighs> Avoiding all these monsters is taking us a long time. True, we stand no chance against most of them in, in battle. I'm sorry for not being much help. What are you talking about? Without you, I would not dare cross these mountains. So I'm talking about best character on the team. What you talking about? Glenn, are you all right? Let's set up camp. The sun is setting away. Say, I, I know it's none of my business, but what do you have to do? What do you plan to do about your brother? Ty has said, seemed to have confirmed that Prince Frederick ordered the murder of Lady Parnella. Ty's a liar. I do not believe a word he says. Don't get me wrong, Glenn. I'm not some naive girl who, despite all evidence, thinks her brother's innocent. I know him better than any other person in the world, and I know exactly what he's capable of. And it's not a little. But that does not mean he gave his order in this case, nor does this mean I can't not prevent a war from talking by talking to him. I need to see the bigger picture with my own eyes and not betray my brother based on statements of someone who tried to murder me. I mean, good point. You're right. Who else who you can trust but your own family? To see the bigger picture, that was the was also the reason why I fled the castle. You can't understand what it's like to watch the world only on the horizon while you sit idly in the bay window of the tower. You don't know what it's like to be locked up behind the walls all your life. Actually, I know that only all too well. You do? The city where I came from was from a huge prison. There was a giant pit on the ground. Some rotting buildings built in mud with high walls around them. The guards opened up the gates, threw the prisoners inside, and closed the gates behind them. They did not care for what happened inside. The laws of the strongest ruled in there. And if you were strong, hardworking, and had a lot of luck, you were sold as a slave and could leave the city. Are you talking about, are you talking perchance about Gotoa? Yes, I was born, born by on the walls, the son of a prisoner. You said you could see the world only through the horizon? I couldn't even do this. I don't even know what the horizon looks like. People talk about it, but I could not imagine. Rounded by walls, all I knew was the sky above me and the mud beneath my feet. You are a survivor from Gotoa? I did not know that. I'm sorry. How foolish of me. You could have known. After the Jade Exodus, oh, Jadar Exodus, I was freed and joined the band of the Iron Bulls. Being a prison for such a long portion of my life is probably the reason why I enjoy flying sky armor so much. Up there, I feel, I can look beyond every mountain, beyond every wall, and now the troop is no more. When we reach Tarn, I can see to it that you are generously rewarded. You could use this as capital to start over. That is Krellian's most sincere wish. If I were to choose them, tell me. Back during the battle in Wishar, I was in the center of the explosion that engulfed it. Wait, you were in the middle of it? How did you survive? I do not know. The explosion pulverized buildings, killed people, vaporized water, and melted skin. But both Krelly and I, we didn't have the slightest scratch. The cause of the explosion was, it looked like a grimoire. Not the magic tones behind you, but these crystal stones that you put in, into a book to cover. It was bigger than the usual stone and retracted, refracted, large shone in colors of the rainbow. A grimoire? Are you sure? I don't know, know it. I do not know of any with such power, but some rulers of Atlantis seem to know it's only true too well, and Curly and I are searching for information. We want to know what this is all about. So that's why he's sneaking to the palace, and that's why we're traveling to Tormund and trying to help you. We would like to ask your brother to share all his information about the Grimoire with us. You speak of a weapon so powerful that it can end wars on its own. I doubt my brother would share information if he actually possesses any, but I will ask him, I promise you. Thanks, Lynn. This explosion is still hunts me. Finding information on what happened that day is my only way of dealing with it. I will do my best to help you. Sorry. Stop being sorry. Yes, uh, let's sleep then. 
more we talk about this topic, the harder for me to for me to get a good night's sleep, find a good sleep. So be it. Good night, Glenn. Yeah, my man's had a he had a he had a rough. Good night, Glenn. You know we gotta get to know more our characters a little bit better as we go on this journey. You there, wake up. Huh? Soldiers? Do we like soldiers to you? What do you want? Do you know where you are? This is a holy place. You have no business here. Ah, my head. Damn it. Watch out. It hurts. Sorry, we didn't know where we were. It's not like we... It was not like on purpose. These are secret woods. Anyone who entered this forest is sentenced to death. Why are you here then? Mm -hmm. well, hold still or I won't be able to bandage you. We have a state of emergency. Our village, Wallon, was attacked by a beast. We wounded it badly, but the beast fled. We are chasing it before it can recover. A beast? Looks like a mix between a bear and a wild boar. Had bright red eyes and is huge. For the wounds we inflicted on it, three men had to pay with their lives, and four, I mean five others were seriously injured. Serena, we should not stay here any longer. We are all exhausted. A short break is necessary. The beast will not get far away. Can you forgive us for trans trespassing in a state of emergency? You are armed and let you can your weapons. We'll rest for a moment and then we'll follow then you will follow us. You want us to help you take down this beast? Don't worry, it can hardly defend itself anymore. Don't help them, Glenn. You can put yourself in danger. Who are you? What do you want from me? My man's going crazy? Let us help. We have different objectives. Have you forgotten? I know, but haven't you heard? Bright red eyes, just like the demon at the banquet. Maybe there's a connection. Besides, we don't have a choice anyway, or should we be hanged for entering this forest? Of course not. All right, get ready while we're resting. I don't know who, who made you the law, but I'm just going to do whatever I want. The wrong way? I mean, we have to help him. Austin's eyes are glowing. The red is possessed by some magic. The locals. Yeah, I don't, I'm not talking to you fools no more. Huh? A fairy? Stop kidding. There's, this is no fairy tale. Now, where is it? All right, I guess we're going to continue our chase. We can't open. Looks like we can't open our map. We're just in some mysterious area. All right, where you go? It almost feels like it's showing us the way. But where to? I don't know. I don't know about these guys. It doesn't seem like anything else is around here. Just keep going. There we go. Some snacks. We can definitely use some of those. Oil lamp to give that this on purpose. Don't go any further. Ah! What's going on, Glenn? It hurts so much, the voice inside of my head. Glenn, what are you talking about? It's here. Hmm? Have you seen something? Uh, you might want to go grab her. I can't really see a thing. Anything. Pretty sure you can hear that, though. Focus, Glenn. It's a trap. Glenn, dodge! It did put a good beating on it. This is a red, a red, red-eyed beast. How do you know it was coming? Um, tuition, I guess. Did you hear their laughter? These four spirits or whatever have set us they have they are have they have set us up. Maybe we can defeat it. Look at his injuries. We have no choice, other choice. There's no turning back anymore. So this is telling us about the items that can apply uh debuffs. So that oil lamp chip uh chest that we got a couple seconds ago can make this enemy weak to uh, fire. I'm gonna save my um TP. And now we can pop this. We can drop this. Oh, I gotta find it. We can drop the oil lamp. And inflict oil. Which would do uh make him weak against fire for one for one attack. I'm just gonna pop this, because Nolan needs to heal us. It's a little early. It's fine. 
Alright, you can do this. It gets too much, we'll just start using snacks instead. Right, I'm just gonna pop this armor break on. Actually, I didn't even do that. Yeah, I forgot he counterattacks. So we might want to just not do that. We might want to just stick to using the uh, oil lamp. Since we don't, so we don't take extra damage. Kind of wasted a lot of TP, so you know what? You need to pop a sweet, actually. We can just do this. We'll have you throw an oil lamp. And since you're debuff right now, I am going to just do this. He only attacks once. Actually, he does hit both of us. Right? Maybe that's not the best move. We'll heal. And I think I'll just. Uh, are you still oiled? Yeah, oh, it's about to be gone. Uh, I have to wait. Alright, I'll just defend for now. Yeah, it's gone. Shit. Here, a Papa snack. I forgot, it's like, you gotta really just like use it right away. So it only lasts, I think it only lasts for like what? Two turns? Two of the enemy's turn. We're gonna get that oil. We'll drop another one. The turn's coming up again. Yeah, he's still debuffed right now. Hit him with another one. And we'll heal him with a snack. I think we're just going to... Um, I am going to cleanse because I need to get this overdrive down. Take the counterattack damage. Oh, it actually doesn't count. Pop another sweets on her. And I'm just gonna save my TP. I'm just gonna heal with snack again. And now we can just do the oil combo again. Oil lamp. It's fine. We can build. Once we get the tarn, we can actually buy, buy some of these. Alright, I'm going to armor break. And it's done. Not too bad. I don't hear her laughter anymore. The four spirits lured us towards this monster, but why? Glenn, you do not look well. Color has left your cheeks. I, I... You should have listened to me. That beast you defeated now and the demon that attacked the baker were both born from the planet. Born from Eldra, and they share one common goal. It's to hunt you down and kill you. You understand, Glenn? The world wants to see you dead. Glenn! And that is going to be the end of, of their adventure there. So I'm going to save uh, Krellian, Victor, and Rob for last because it's actually the most difficult and the longest. So we're going to do Sienna's next. But it doesn't really matter what order you do. Cursed mission. It's not worth the money. If they survive, they'll make it without my help. I'm out of here. No signs of them, not even their bodies. Maybe they already escaped. Not that it matters. Once, they, once their wanted posters is up, it won't take a week until they hang from the gallows. Hmm, they don't need eyewitnesses from mugshots? We both were standing closet closest to them, but you really remember what they all look like? I don't. Now that you mention it, not really. That could be a problem. For a moment, I thought this could get troublesome, but well, it looks like the matter has settled itself. Only if I remember that one, only, I only remember that woman in the back had red hair. What? <laughs> she carried a sword of Suna and wore a red dress, right? True, her eyes were green and she had a birthmark on her left eye. If I had to guess, I would say she was about 1.8 millimeter uh, M tall and weighed about 55 K kg. No wonder they don't remember what those look like. They're too busy. They're only, looks like they're only staring at me. So at least one, at least this one mug shot would work, should work. Exactly, soon as we find Soon she'll find herself in jail, 
and there's no way to escape that fate. That's right. She should have had it. She should. She would have to do a truly heroic deed to be pardoned. Yeah, say something like find the real Princess Celestia and bring her, her safely to her brother, Termon. Yes, damn it, I get it. I'll help the princess. What was that? Maybe I catch her at the right Rose Inn and Sir Victor talked about. I could still escort them through the Fjord Wood. I believe there is a town east of here. That might, there might be a way to cross the cannon. All right, so we're, I shouldn't go there. I just want to get that, that collectible. But we have to now escape this dangerous ass area with Sienna. So we definitely wanted to try to avoid encounters if we can. We'll just take this right area. We can definitely explore here later. Did I get this one already? No, this is a different part of the map. Is it over here? It's definitely not there. Where's the second? Can't go that way. Oh, so it has to be, it has to be like over there. But I can't, can't really make it safely. You can get this crystal though. I am going to grab that actually. It's more common. Nice. Get that heavy armor bonus. Boost the damage you take. Can't be too stingy on what the crystals I can get right now. Bloody compass. Junk. Just a bunch of junk for us to pick up. I'm not seeing anything too interesting. Oh, there's a rock for us to break. Definitely do that. Oh, yes. I'll definitely take the money. 856 is not bad at all. It's a very odd Pacific number, but I ain't complaining. Yeah, pretty easy to not get any encounters there. What's the hustle and bustle at rock bottom? A year ago, a bandit group took over the leadership here. They've been chasing, I mean, causing a lot of trouble ever since. Seems like they've also had problems with Ternarian soldiers. What are they doing here anyway? Currently, they are everywhere in Qatar. They even closed the main route. Is there a new war in the making? All I know is we should steer clear soldiers. They only confiscate our goods. Unfortunately, the only way north is through the village here. So you have to wait until the situation calms down. All right, let's set up our tents then. Well, we ain't got time to do all that. Unfortunately, I don't have time to take a break like you, you my dears. I have to get through here, here somehow. Huh? Oh joy, how did we? How did it get here so quickly? So I need to get past some bandits, tyrant soldiers, as well as the Black Sun Gang. Easy game, you could do it, Sienna. Yeah, it's pretty free. It's pretty easy. But uh, we should probably equip this this warrior uh, class M woman. Uh, make sure we upgrade the right skill. So now it is 2.2 .2 damage at a 20 at 35 TP cost. Okay, so now we can we can't go that way. Just gotta sneak around. Shit's too easy out here when you're a master thief. Except, uh, you know, I'm going the, the wrong way. Any uh, things for us to pick up in these houses? I mean, you could talk to her. Get the miner's lunch. Need to get, need to do that to get through. But yeah, I don't think there's any, like, treasures in here. All right, now we, now we can get through to this guy. And we don't even have to deliver the meal to her husband. We just... Use that as an excuse as we get a free HP up. We'll take this, and I think there's a chest down here. Jute fabric, I think that we can use that to upgrade somebody's weapon or armor. Oh, super important. Get the break of thunder. We're gonna, I'm just gonna make a big chain of this right now. I'll take that. I wanna hold on to that, because that is, one of the most important crystals we're gonna need. I don't know if we can get crystal information off of here. Yes, we can. So let's just go. Let me go talk about it real quick. This it's in. Uh, these on what is it? Uh, offensive. 
So a debuff has 35 chance to extend longer for three turns at max level at level 10. 50% chance and you can use that to combine with uh, Glenn's ultra move and have it to double the, the effect of his uh, ability. So an enemy could be debuffed for like six turns, like attack, and that'll be super good. So we definitely want to get level 10 of a break extender. So I'm gonna keep that changed. Hopefully it pops up a little bit more. When I'm done with work, I'll have a nice cup of tea of after work cocoa. So yeah, let's go over here. This is on, on my original run here. I actually was doing before this patch where you can choose what stuff you got. So it's actually uh, gonna help us a lot here. All right, we're gonna upgrade your Copus for sure. You know, you just got done and Sienna, I'm pretty sure I can upgrade your stuff. Nice, there we go. That'll be good for you. And how about your armor? Since you're the one fighting, it's, it's, already, it's already upgraded. I'll break this metal jerkin. No one's using that right now. All right, I think we're good to go. Go inside. These sections are pretty, not too long. Well, well, the infamous Black Sun Gang. What do we owe to honor? Hope you aren't trying to compete for our resources of income. If you do, then there's no inf infamous trophies will soon adorn my walls. <laughs> Is he threatening us, brothers? I would advise you put down your weapons. You don't want to mess with Valanda's most notorious band of thieves. We're not here on business, Norgot. We're in pursuit of a woman. She's probably crossing Kotara through Tormund. Why could a per what kind of could a person possibly done to to make you chase him through this god this place? She meddled in our business too often. Metal, metal. She has red hair and wears equally red clothes. She is quite good looking for a human. Have you seen her? Good looking ladies around here, but I can't offer you a red hair one. Mwa. If she so shows up, let us know. You ask a favor of me? First, we should get to know each other. Come take a place at my table. Soldiers are running around the town and I would... I should take the stairs and get out of there. Do it. A uh, suspicious looking man. Look at this place. Look at that. This whole place is crawling with bandits and crooks. Where illegal money flows, a famous Dovolo soldier like you is not far away, right? How about you help me out? Do you know who, we're, who we are? You're Betraz, are you? He's well known among mercenaries. A Levisian who can... Who speaks himself in plurals and wears metal prophecies for arms and legs. He can move that which he moves by magic. There are rumors that he received the skill in, the, in return for the pack. Since then, as a part of the curse, he can summon magical weapons in battle and bend metal to his will. And surely you know our price. Uh, let's see. Is that enough? Whatever you want to do, for this money we won't even put down this drink. Come back when you actually have something to pay. Alright, so we gotta go get some cash. Obviously, I, I remember how to do that, I think. Maybe, I think we just have to go down this way. This guy's asleep. Don't don't mind him. Guess I'll take some free water bombs. Don't mind me. There's a hole in the floor. Do I jump down? Oh, yeah. This is Nork's treasury. Let's stock up a bit. These coins should be enough. I can't carry anymore. Can't say this no, no to this fancy amulet. And we're done. Alright, we just robbed this man blind. A little bit. I mean, we couldn't take it all, but... Now we can pay our, our man here to help us out and get us out of here. Where are you at? There you are. Let's see. Is this enough? Hmm, looks good. What do you want us to do? I just want to cat cross Katora. Help me get the, out of the city and reach Farmwood. Bodyguard it is, huh? All right. We'll help you when you're fighting against monsters. But we won't touch any the soldiers. We don't want to ru ruin our reputation. All right. So we got our new party member here. As I he doesn't have anything. We're going to give him. He's another mage. He has a, he's pretty. He's uh, He's got light and dark spear. So he's, he's the only one of the few characters have natural uh, light and dark attacks in his, in his kit. Comes with machine killer, which is eh. The thing about uh, 
Beatrice is that normally he will summon weapons and you combine that for big damage, but he stuck with just using a single target dark attack and a light attack to use it all. He still is useful, but he's just, he's really like nerfing this part. So he's going to be our other character that's going to be, have to learn heal all. And he starts off with 300 SP for us to work with. So he only needs 265 to get to level three. So now we just have to get him, get our ass out of here. This is going to be a big help as we get this money. I'm all about that. How are we doing funds wise? Okay ish. I haven't sold anything, so we're not getting it past here. Only if we can disguise ourselves. You haven't seen a clothing store, have you? Oh, yes, the clothing store. First, let's go grab this because I see it. We just have to go back to here. He's sleeping. Just a moment. Using those metal powers already. How did you do that? You don't see Levisians who can wield magic often. So the rumors are true. You made a pack and received the curse. Bear us the gossip, or you want our price to go up. Let's use the armor and get past the soldier at the exit. Alright, you heard the man. Someone here is very sensitive. Alright, now we got everything we need to get the hell up out of here. Alright, Mr. Soldier, you want to continue? Yeah, yeah. This is our last chance to go back. You say yes, you have to proceed forward and you can't go back anymore. Hate wearing armor. Reminds me of the old days. Anyway, it worked. Let's let's move on. Hmm, I wonder what those old days she's talking about she's heading at. And now we just have to go follow the pretty uh, straight path. And we're coming to the end of uh, Sienna's uh, fate adventure here. Alright, let's go. Anything else around here that I want? Oh, we got our map open here. Can't go that way. So just for more stuff for us to pick up. Yeah, you can see uh Kotaro's pretty big too, man. There's a there's a there's two towns in here. Pretty big area as we uh, fight this dude. And now we have a power swing option. Well he's weak to earth, so it doesn't really do anything. Oh really? That's some shit. Can I steal from you? I cannot. I'm just gonna regular attack. Hey dude, can you can you wake up already, man? Can we get the overdrive? Oh of course. Oh he'll heal all instead. Alright, nice. The egg does nothing, so now we can get a nice strong single target attack for her. I guess we hit you with the dark spear because it's 1.7. Weapon summon, but we can't really do anything. Take it out the power swing. Let's take him out. Definitely want to get some stuff from these guys. Okay, maybe it's not quite as over as I thought. But you know what? Uh, yeah, I guess since it's, it's been quite a bit, I think we're gonna end seeing this thing next time. So come back to the channel. Keep bringing it to you. Like, comment, subscribe, and see you.